Hi, welcome to another tutorial with me. My name is Ivan. Today I'm going to show you a very simple tutorial, a very easy one. Many people know how to do it. Um, it's to create a circle. It sounds easy, it is easy, so let's get started. So I'm just going to create a new layer just by clicking this icon here. Or you can press Ctrl, Alt, Shift and N. Sorry, I'll push delete there by accident. Um, and that creates a new layer. I only want one layer, so I'm just going to work off that. So the two ways to do it, you've got your elliptical marquee tool just over here, which is your selection tool. I'm just going to change the, the colors here just so you can see the different ones when I create them. Foreground is blue and background is green. Okay, so it's way to do it. You can either just click and drag and you can adjust how you want it to look. Controls D to deselect. Or you can hold down shift and click and drag and it keeps it scaled correctly. Okay, so that's the outline of the, the circle. Press Control and delete to fill it with your background color. Or Alt and delete to fill it with your foreground color. Okay, it sounds that easy, and it is that easy. Um, so that's how to create it with the elliptical marquee tool. <clears throat> Down here on the toolbar, you can go to your ellipse tool, and you can just do exactly the same. A little bit different, I'll show you up here in a moment. You can click and drag, and it will fill it with whichever fill color you decide. Let's fill it with the blue, which it is. And we can have a stroke of our background color and you can adjust the size of the stroke um, it's up to you how you, how big you want it to go um, depending what you're creating and just remember once you have your outline it always fills it inwards um, okay unless you change the settings on that and you can change the stroke pattern you can have it a straight line a dotted line and more dots Okay, so that's that tutorial. Very simple, very easy. Hope you found it helpful. Please subscribe for more to come. I have plenty of tutorials for you to follow and I have plenty more to come. Thank you.